Well, good morning, everyone. It is what we traditionally call Good Friday, the day that we remember, celebrate, and proclaim that Christ died for our sins. Tonight at 7 o'clock, no matter where you are, you can join us for Church Online live from our Gaylord campus and you can take part of our Good Friday communion service. Have a little something to eat, have a little something to drink, participate in communion with us. It'll be a special time, seven o'clock tonight. Well, for today's morning check-in, we have been going through Psalm 22. So here's why I'd like to do something different, something I've never done on a morning check-in. I just wanna read Psalm 22. I'm not gonna comment, I'm not gonna make any um, explanation. I just want to read it. I want you to listen as the psalmist predicts the coming death of Jesus Christ. And here's what he says. My God, my God, why have you forsaken me? Far from my deliverance are the words of my groaning. Oh my God, I cry by day, but you do not answer. And by night, but I have no rest. Yet you are holy. O oh, you who are enthroned upon the praises of Israel, in you our fathers trusted. They trusted and you delivered them. To you they cried out and were delivered. In you they trusted and were not disappointed. But I am a worm and not a man, a reproach of men and despised by the people. All who see me sneer at me. They separate with the lip. They wag their head saying, commit yourself to the Lord. Let him deliver him. Let him rescue him because he delights in him. Yet you are he who brought me forth from the womb. You made me trust when upon my mother's breasts. Upon you I was cast from birth. You have been my God from my, father's, from my mother's womb. Be not far from me, for trouble is near, for there is none to help. Many bulls have surrounded me. Strong bulls of Bashan have encircled me. They open wide their mouth at me as a ravening and roaring lion. I am poured out like water. And all my bones are out of joint. My heart is like wax. It is melted within me. My strength is dried up like a potsherd, and my tongue cleaves to my jaws, and you lay me in the dust of death. For dogs have surrounded me. A band of evildoers has encompassed me. They pierced my hands and my feet. I can count all my bones. They look, they stare at me. They divide my garments among them. And for my clothing, they cast lots. But you, O oh Lord, be not far off. O oh, you, my help, hasten to my assistance. Deliver my soul from the sword, my only life from the power of the dog. Save me from the lion's mouth, from the horns of the wild oxen, you answer me. I will tell of your name to my brethren. In the midst of the assembly, I will praise you. You who fear the Lord, praise him. All you descendants of Jacob, glorify him and stand in awe of him. All you descendants of Israel. And that is my prayer for you and I today. That as we remember and proclaim the cross of Christ, that we will praise our Lord. That we will glorify our Lord. That we will stand in awe of Him. And that's why I encourage you, be part tonight of our Good Friday communion service right here, live, online. So Father, thank you for this special day. We look forward to celebrating you tonight. And we pray this all in Jesus' name. Amen. Good Friday tonight, Easter. We'll have a special morning check-in. And then all of our Easter services, I hope you'll be part. We hope to see you tonight.